If I can see the North Star from the Southern Hemisphere, I guess the world is flat. Only the color of gold would suffice. A golden sun disk, 2000 BC. A ceremonial necklace, 800 BC. And the most remarkable of all, a sun chariot from 1500 BC. Now the star exhibit at the National Museum of Denmark. This is one of the most remarkable things I've ever seen in a museum. It's utterly breathtaking. Because what we have here, essentially, is a three and a half thousand year old miniature model chariot in virtually mint condition. So you can see there's this utterly delightful bronze horse with its ears pricked up attentively and it's standing on these four wheels and dragging this great disc behind it. And that disc is the sun. And for the people who made this, the sun was a great golden goddess that was being carried by this divine horse every day across the sky from east to west and then back again at night. And it is believed that the elders of the community, the priests, would actually pull it around back and forth to teach people about the importance of the sun. And it's decorated with all these exquisite patterns that represent the radiating rays of the sun, that pulsating light, and its movement through the years. It's an explicit connection between the color of gold and the color of the sun. Both of them have this warm, radiant yellowness. Both of them have this terrific sparkle. And both of them have this eternal shine. Because it's three and a half thousand years later now, everything else has deteriorated. But the gold on this disc, like the sun outside this room, is still shining. The desire to honor the sun with gold